so out the gate, congratulations to Taylor Robertson. Uh, she was able to to get the the victory. Um, yeah, against Euseline Rodriguez. But here's here's the deal with this, and and obviously Taylor Robertson, she got the the belt. I don't want to take nothing away from her or nothing away from the performance, but the referee stoppage in the tenth round was ridiculous. Uh, Rodriguez had made it to the tenth round. There, she's been getting hit all night, and obviously the corner, her corner was just trying to get to a decision, and Robertson was going to win a decision, but she, the stoppage just was not necessary. It it really wasn't. I mean, when she got hit, she was not in any more danger than she was in the second round, you know. So, so the referee stoppage was crazy. I think it just came down to he he got pressure from the from people outside of the ring, people telling him to stop it. And but Rodriguez was was as fine as fine could be. So was she getting hit in there? Yeah, but was she getting hit? to the point where she had even, he hadn't even warned her. That's what's so crazy about it is he didn't even warn Rodriguez that, Hey, show me something. He, he never did. He just, he was just looking around watching or whatever like that. He obviously didn't think that it was that crazy. Um, there was some holding from Rodriguez, but anybody that's hurt is going to be holding. So I don't, like I said, I, I'm not trying to take anything away from Taylor, uh, Taylor Robertson. Obviously, uh, I mean, Taylor did an amazing job. She was poised in there. She looked great. She had some speed in there. I'm not too sure about the power too much. I don't think that the power was really there. Um, She could have definitely gone down to the body a whole lot more to soften up the opponent. Uh, it It seemed like she was head hunting a lot, and she was getting frustrated that the, that, she wasn't getting the any knockdowns or anything like that. There was nothing. I mean, there was nothing that was in there that showed versatility in the attack from Taylor Robertson. There was a lot of upstairs shots, but nothing that was too tricky. You know, very one dimensional. But that's all you needed in this fight. You see what I'm saying? So that at the end of the day, she was the she was top notch. She was clearly in the driver's seat from really midway into the into the first round. I say like, yeah, late first round. Rodriguez did come out there swinging at the beginning, but then when Robertson clipped her pretty pretty good, um, then she was like, all right, let me back up because obviously there's something back there. I don't know how much is back there, but there's something. So. Yeah, I just didn't like. I didn't like this. I didn't like the stoppage at all. But whatever. I'm not the ref. And then one of the commentators he said, "Well, what would he do if he if that was his daughter?" When have you ever heard anything like that? Ever? No. There's there's never been a a referee that's had to think, "What if that was my son?" Like until. Female fighters start to get the same respect as male fighters. It's always going to be women boxing, you know, and they need to have three round fights. I mean, uh, three minute fights and they need to have for championship fights. It it needs to be 10. Well, it needs to be 12 rounds for championship fights and everything else needs to be 10 or eight, you know, depending. But yeah, I didn't like that. I didn't like it at all. So, yeah, they need to have 12 minute, I mean, 12 round fights for championship fights, and they need to have three minute rounds. So, that's just my two cents. But regardless of all that rant, big shouts out to Taylor Robinson. I, that is all that is not to take away from her performance. It was an amazing performance. I said that out the gate like, amazing performance by Taylor Robinson. Her team got her in tip-top shape. Everything was clicking. I just think that they should have gone to the body a lot more. And I thought that the referee stoppage was terrible. But 
that does not mean that Taylor Robertson is not an amazing champion and does not mean that Taylor Robertson didn't just demolish Rodriguez because she did. So, yeah, good good uh, morning of boxing. We're hyped up. We're, you know, man, dude, the sun is, is about to come out in probably about 30 minutes. And we're going, you know what I'm saying? We're going to be feeling energized. So, yeah, it's all good. So we're here looking at Australia under the bright lights. So with that being said, as always, peace, one love. I'll see you at the top. Hey.